All right, so let's move on to our last topic of the conversation for today. And that is Ben Askren, where you at, buddy? I mean, you have a fight coming up. And your opponent, he's been making um, a lot of noise in the MMA, MMA world. He's been posting all the stuff that he's been training. And he's been talking a lot of smack. And you have been very silent. What's going on, Ben? I would love to hear from you. I'm not trying to be a hater. I'm just trying to be a fighter. I'm not... And you guys, if you guys know that I am picking against uh, Ben Askin to Ben Askren for his fight coming up versus uh, Jake Paul because, well, it is a boxing match. It's not a mixed martial arts. There's no wrestling. There's no takedown. There's no jiu-jitsu. And it's just a pure stand-up. But I could see a chance of him winning. He has not been Askren. He's not known for his, for his wrestling. And I realized that he is getting older. He's 36 right now. And his opponent, Jake Paul, he is 24. So Jake Paul is coming into his prime. Ben Askren is coming to a bit of a tail end. And he also just um, got a surgery, a hip, hip surgery, I believe. But Ben, man, where are you? I'd love to hear from you. Post, th- post something. I follow you on Instagram and Twitter. But <laughs> I, just, I just want to be entertained. Ben, what's going on, man? Where you at? Where have you been hiding? Who are you? Who have you? Who are you practicing with? Who are you getting prepared with to face um your next fight? And this is, like I said, it, it is gonna be it is gonna be a fight. I am looking forward to it. I realized that you could call me casual, which is whatever. That's what I am. I am a casual hardcore. I am right right between. I don't follow or stalk these guys, but. I like to be entertained to the form of fighting, the form of mixed martial arts, but also not just not just that. I like to watch the lead up into the fight as well. And leading up to his fight with uh, Jake Paul. That's just me. Uh, I'm just double check when that is. I believe it's April seventeenth. Oh. So it's been uh, released that this is this is new for me. Um, Jake Paul and Ben Askren will be take place in New York. That's new. Oh, sorry, it comes with a question mark. Trick me, these guys. Whoa! What the heck? Whatever. I believe that their fight is on um, April seventeenth. I'm not even going to. I'm not even going to do that much that much research into it. But yeah, April seventeenth, Ben. It's around the corner. What's going on, man? What are you up to? Let us know. We would love to hear from you. Not just me, not just the fan, but I am also sure that your opponent, Jake Paul, would like to hear from you as well. He would. He would like to know um, that you you've been training. But on the flip side, I don't think he would like you to train because he wants an easy fight, which I cannot blame him. I would like an easy fight too. And I realized that you were on Errol Hwani's show saying that this is the biggest fight purse in your career. How much is that? Could you let, could you let, could you let us know? I would like to know. I mean, he he, and Jake Paul did offer Conor McGregor, Conor McGregor $50 million dollars. And after Conor McGregor's loss, he did offer ten thousand in cash, in cash, money talks, man. So Ben, where you at, Ben? Yeah, okay. So guys, that is uh, my quick thought on Ben Askren. I don't know where he is. I don't know who he's been trading with. I would love to hear from him. So, yeah. And I am looking forward to the fight. Like I just pre- pre- previously mentioned, I believe that Ben Askren is going to lose because of his age, because of his surgery. And Jake Paul, he's too young and he's coming into his prom. And Jake Paul is not a... It's not a person that's... It's not a person that's just off the street. It's not... 
his first rodeo. So yeah, Ben, hopefully you are preparing well. I'm looking to fight between you and Jake Paul. Take care. Okay, so you guys, that is my quick thought that I just mentioned on, on the two fighters.